SAMPATLAB 7 comes with a new set of parameters which can be displayed in corresponding tiles or reports. If we open a professional report, you can see that there are two new report pages which are swing plane and shaft plane. We go to the swing plane report and we open it for a single PUT. On the left side you see the swing plane in this case, the swing plane tilt angle is 26 degrees against the vertical. The swing plane can be very much matching up to the shaft plane in a neutral setup, which is about 20 degrees. The swing plane is a fit of your putter path into a perfect rotational movement. On the right side you see other results for the calculated swing plane. You can also see that in PATLAB 7 we have now the option to display results in imperial units such as feet or inches. The swing plane radius is the center of your swing plane and for this putt is 4.5 one two feet which is rated of being neutral. The swing radius is higher in this case at begin of impact zone and then decreases throughout the impact zone. The low point of the swing plane is also the lowest point of your swing and is normally just before impact which allows you to have a positive angle of attack through impact. In this case the low point is 4.3 inches before impact. The swing plane direction at the low point, which corresponds to the center of your swing plane also, is 3.3 degrees to the right. And this is different from the path direction at impact. If the path is curved to the inside and the low point is before impact, then normally the path will be more slightly left as compared to the swing direction. The vertical arc also depends on the swing radius. For a small radius the vertical arc will be rather increased. For this part the vertical arc is 12.4 degrees per feet which is rated of being slightly reduced.